They took three of five from both Mississippi and Chattanooga, and they return home to face Luis Madero, whose first pitch, that is swung on and hit in the air to center. Back goes Marsh at the wall. He looks. This ball is gone. That sounds like a pretty good time. <laughs> yeah. Three, two. This is well struck into right field. Going back is the right fielder way. He turns and it's gone. The second home run of the night for Travis Blankenhorn. The hitter stands in from the left side, and the first offering from Bettinger is hit out into center field. Grisham fighting the sun, chases it. It's blown out, and that ball is gone. Ten home runs apiece. This one is driven deep out into right field. Back is Dylan Thomas. He's at the wall. He's reaching up, and it is gone. We are tied. A two-run home run by Travis Blankenhorn. As Swung on and hit high and deep to right. This should leave the yard. And Travis Blankenhorn has a two-run shot. Swings essentially by the Blue Wahoos. And that will, of course, send Jacksonville pitching coach Bruce Walton out to have a quick conversation. Now.com. 1-0. Fastball swing. And that's drilled high, deep in the air to right field, and gone. That one hits a palm tree just beyond the bleachers, beyond right field, as Travis Blankenhorn collects a solo homer on the second pitch he saw from Caleb Smith, and that gives the Blue Wahoos a 1-0 lead in the top of the first. Blankenhorn's got plenty of power for Pensacola. That's his second homer of the series and also his 13th. 